would like to tell you the story about OptiPlus, a new educational furniture collection, by raising the question, why the need for new product development? A product is in many cases not a standalone product. It has to fit and function in a global, larger picture. A picture with many elements that are linked together. Before starting a design, it is very important to capture all these elements, which can influence the design of your product, concept or service. The fact that these elements are constantly changing, even more rapidly than in the past, it is of great importance for a design team to define these elements, these changes and relations, and to put all these in a perspective related with the future. With this, we started the design when we received the assignment for a new educational furniture collection. We would like to begin with a summary of items which have influenced our design the most. First, we have seen that the relationship between pupil and tutor is evolved to a more open relation and less hierarchical. Their opinion is more respected and they are expected to communicate and interact more. Also, the way of education is changed to a more dynamic, diverse way. Interaction between individual teaching, group working, between inside and outside the classroom. Education is often not dedicated anymore to one specific classroom, but students are changing from one classroom to another according to the course they need to follow. This means that the idea that each student needs to have his personal, individual table is getting less important. Much more important is the fact that each student can sit in a comfortable, ergonomically way, on site where they need to be and where they have a place to put their personal belongings. The second important item of influence are new insights on ergonomics. For the last century, work chairs for schools have been designed for sitting upright, with the hip, knees and ankles all at right angles. Until recently, it is widely believed that sitting with a 90 degree bending of the hip joint preserves the natural healthy curve of the back. This erect position looks very nice, but it is impossible to sit this way for long and there is no scientific basis for it. This erect sitting posture cannot be maintained for more than one or two minutes. It induces bending of the back and results in fatigue and discomfort. New insights in ergonomics introduced by ergonomist and spine surgeon Mandel are telling us that a sitting posture that approaches the natural resting position is a more suitable position and allows the spine to carry the body weight in a more comfortable way. This we call balanced seating. From further economic experiments we learn that we obtain the exact natural resting position by placing the work surface higher than standard. Muscles are relaxed and the body is in a perfect posture for balanced seating. Through the easy way of adjusting the footrest, OptiPlus offers an ergonomically workplace for each different individual on site where needed. The resulting posture will enhance the performance, efficiency and well-being of students and tutors. Education and educational environments are more and more confronted with the integration of digital media and information technology. Environments and student desks should be adapted in a way that students can work in a proper way with these new technologies. We are spotting a growing global ecological awareness. Public is aware of the need for sustainable products. Ecological design does not reflect only on the product itself. Greener product design means designing the whole product system from a life cycle perspective. In modern architecture, we see the merge of new materials. In the 1950s, schools used terrazzo or stone paving, which lasts forever. Nowadays, materials like linoleum, vinyl, polyurethane or carpet are being used. The technical properties of these materials are completely different than the materials used before. Most of them are more vulnerable and therefore chairs need to have appropriate matching glides. Many studies prove, and personally I'm also convinced, that working or learning in a pleasant environment 
enhance the performance, efficiency and well-being of students. Therefore, it is of primary importance that a product looks good and contributes to an inspirational environment. A nice, well-thought product earns also more respect from the user. Besides these functional requirements where many manufacturers can succeed, it is also important that the product fulfill these more emotional aspects which are situated on a high level.